I'm Sam Mattis, an Olympic discus thrower for Team USA in Paris and Tokyo. Did you know that apparel accounts for up to 10% of global carbon emissions? The good news is we can do something about it. We can wear longer, buy used, and choose to buy only from sustainable brands. But to make an even bigger impact, we need to think about systemic change. Two ways we can do this are by voting climate and talking about climate change. And to start the conversation about climate change, I'll pass it over to Holly. I'm Halle Ol, a senior on the Rutgers University swim team and an eco-athletes champion. Experts say that talking about climate change is one of the most impactful things that you can do to help create systemic change. Sometimes, because the topic can be uncomfortable, we hesitate to start these conversations. Let's make it comfortable and relatable. Talk about clothes. Everyone wears them and everyone wants a healthy environment. So let's discuss how, by making our clothes a force for good, we can drive broader climate actions. See, that's not so hard, right, Amy? Absolutely, Holly. I'm Amy Steele, a retired pro athlete from Australia. I'm a PhD candidate in climate adaptation and a climate activist and communicator. I don't know about you, but sometimes I find this whole global environmental political crisis that we find ourselves in pretty overwhelming and scary. We feel like, what can I do? I'm, I'm just one person. Well, you are just one person, but you have a voice, so use it. Vote for climate and let your friends and family know, let them know your values and that we're counting on them to use their voice and vote too. That's how we make change happen. And that's how we wear our values to be a force for good. Talking and voting are two easy things we can all do that'll have a major impact on accelerating the climate comeback. Imagine what we could do if we have a conversation with someone new once a week about climate change. You can use clothes for good as your conversation starter and encourage your friends and family to vote climate. To learn more about how to make clothes a force for good, go to clothesforgood.net.